Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, dear, dear guests from Montenegro. Today I discussed with the Minister of Justice about the state of play of the reforms that have to be implemented in order to meet the accession negotiations commitments. With the signature of the cooperation agreement with Eurojust, we are one step closer to this objective. The rule of law and fundamental rights are at the heart of the accession process and our contractual relations. They will remain our focus for the next years. The new enlargement strategy adopted last November reconfirms that all countries aspiring to join the EU need to ensure the proper functioning of the core institutions necessary for securing the rule of law. We agreed with the Minister that strengthening the rule of law requires an independent and efficient judiciary and to continue the fight against corruption. These are key priorities on the road to membership. I welcome the good progress made by our Montenegrin colleagues regarding legislation and institutional capacity. However, more efforts are needed in particular as regards track records and achieving concrete results. Reforms need to be effectively implemented. Strengthening our judicial cooperation was another important issue discussed with the Minister today. The various crises that Europe faced, refugees, terrorism and some others, showed once again how important it is to strengthen the collaboration between our authorities. The signing of the cooperation agreement with Eurojust is an important step forward, and in our discussions we also stressed the significance of regional cooperation in this area. The Commission will continue to assist our Montenegrin friends on their path towards membership of the European Union. Thank you.